Mitchell Okami here, and welcome back to another Dragon Ball Z, dis Dragon Ball Z discussion. Now, I, was, I do apologize for it being late due to for um for the video being late because one, I had a lot of stuff going on, didn't want to really explain it, so I just posted up a bunch of different videos, basically testing out some some hits, moves, and stuff like that on the game. And yeah, it's basically making an inspired video. I was inspired by um In Between Gamer. He's a YouTuber. I highly recommend you go and check him out. I will um I will leave a little um I leave a little link at the end of the video so you can check out his channel. So feel free to do that. Now today we're gonna be talking about today we're gonna be talking about Dragon Ball Z Universe Three and what's be possible in the game. I was gonna do the story, do how the story was gonna unfold in the game previously. However, due to the fact due to the fact that my editing software is acting like a total butt and don't want to work at the moment, so I have to do this the old fashioned way. So basically, yeah, I'm recording while I'm playing the game, which is kind of hard for me because it kind of distracts me a lot, as you guys have pretty much well known. So I try to do a gameplay first, then do my voice on top of it, but unfortunately, it's just some since the um, program is not working correctly, I have to do it the fast way, which is play while while I'm on um while I'm on um while I'm on. sorry sorry about that guys I'm, I got distracted at the end basically proving my point um oh shoot why did we try again so basically we're gonna be talking about maps yeah this is gonna be the, this is probably gonna be a short video because one there's not a, lot, not a lot to talk about the maps and a couple new skills, but um, a couple like new skills you can add to the game, but that's really not the best thing. Yeah, so yeah, I do apologize if I pause while I'm playing the game over and over again. I'm not trying to. But when I play games, I try to stay focused. But if I don't stay focused, I lose all the concentration. I get my ass can't do a lot faster. Like, like right now, Zama should not be able to beat Super Saiyan Blue. I should be dominating. Okay? I should be dominating. The only time I should be getting my butt hand to is fighting like something. Like, the hell? What, what, what did Zarbon do? Zama, would you rub your nipples? <laughs> I mean, like, what the hell? May was like, ew, ew, what the hell? Why are you rubbing your nipple for? And then my season, my season dropped. But um, basically, the first idea for the map, I'm going to have the first idea for the map. I want to say Doctor Wheelo's rat lab. You know, from the from the Dragon Ball movie, um, World's Strongest. Am I'm going to go with um Doctor Wheelo's lab because that's. That sounds more cool, cause, cause it, cause it never really had that type of map on any of the Dragon Ball games I've seen so far or have I played so far. So that's one of them. Another idea, which I think is a pretty good one, is the Other World World Tournament Stadium stage, where you can fight on the World Tournament on Goku and Python first fought again. So another, that's one of the stages. And I think there's another one that I thought was with every request that don't know the name of it at the moment. So I do apologize if I don't mention it in the game. That's like my, one of my most OP attacks in the game. I'm gonna power up though. Let's see. Yeah, this is why I meant that I try to avoid playing the game and speaking at the same time. I get so distracted from the game that while I'm stop talking for a little bit. So I do apologize if I'm not talking as much. Now, the reason why I said that World Other World Tournament stage because. I would like the idea of actually fighting the other world tournament and stuff like that. Now, another thing, another stage that they can add will probably be, will have to be, um, 
will have to be. Sorry, guys. I'm trying, trying to remember what it was. I know I got my script somewhere. Oh, here we go. Hold on. Just no. 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 Where did I want to... Where is it? Screw it. We'll, we'll make it work. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I had I had to do that one. I'm sorry. But that's not a bad soundtrack though. Wish they played that during the um during the special story. I mean the DLC story. And yes, I will get to that in a minute. Soon. Now, the next the final part of which is which is now I remember what it was. The most heavily requested um the most heavily requested map stage that they can add to determine a power stage. Which was heavily requested, so I see a lot of people make mods of it, and it looks pretty cool. It's pretty decent. It looks pretty cool and stuff like that. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not even in the secret story mode yet. And yet, I'm Shit! Oh wow! Okay! Okay, so they can maybe one of those OP characters in the game now. Get up before you break my ass! I'm sorry, I shouldn't laugh at that, but then... Another... Another stage that I would probably recommend will probably be like the Toki Toki um, stage. Ooh, no! Not today, Goku! Man, why are you so strong? He's like, he's like strong for no damn reason. <laughs> I swear, when they gave him this a bit, this transformation, it's like this. Let's just make Goku strong for no apparent reason. Uh, where was I before I got distracted and got destroyed by Ultra Instinct Goku just now? Um, yeah, like I said, the Doki Doki. Why I keep saying Doki Doki? God damn it, you bunny. Yes, I'm talking about my sister, Psycho Bunny. She mentioned the game to me a couple of times. And since then, I've been watching a lot of memes, which was dumb on my part. Yeah, never watch memes. Memes are bad for you. <laughs> they're, like, they're like drugs. Don't do drugs. Nope. Anyway, um, as for the Toki Toki stage, you can be either night or day. So that would be a nice little feature. I know it's not exactly... Oh my gosh, what? Okay, I gotta do something about that dog of his. But otherwise, I'm not gonna last long with that. See, look, look how he's destroying me right now. You know what I'm saying, bitch? Super Saiyan Blue was, was ages ago. Get with it. I mean, seriously, how do you beat something that can dodge through like everything? I don't know how the hell I got past this part. Oh, that's how. <laughs> um, there was another thing I wanted to talk about, but I don't think I should mention because I can't really think of any new skills you can add to the game. I guess one of the skills you can probably add to the game will probably uh, what's the that um flame tornado one from um no. Hyper Tornado Attack from PyCon, and yeah, add PyCon to the game too. But um, anyway, guys, I think we want to end the video here. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and please don't forget to hit that notification button. If you don't, you're going to miss out on all of my content, and I'm pretty sure nobody wants that. And, and I do apologize for the massive loss I just did with Ultra Instinct Goku, but what'd you expect? Ultra Instinct Goku pretty much dodges everything you throw at him, as was displayed in today's video. So, um, yeah, yeah, and I know I did mention that sometimes I'll go quiet when playing the game, 
Now nah, I'm rambling. You know what? Let's just end the video here. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and please don't forget to hit the notification button, as I said from before. Also, I will leave a link on my video to In Between Gamer because he he's actually a he's really good at Xenoverse, pretty much a lot better than me, and he does a lot of mods too. So if you are interested in watching Xenoverse mods, feel free to check out his channel because they're pretty good. I think he has a Twitter account. I'm not 100% sure. Speaking speaking of tw speaking of Twitter, I have I now have a Twitter account and a Twitch account account now. So if you guys want to check out more check out. Stuff. You can hit me up on if you want to talk to me on Twitter. You can go ahead if you want. I'm planning on doing, the reason I have a Twitch account is because I'm planning on doing a live stream right now. It's not really put together yet, but I'm putting together a live stream now, so that will be done soon. So I will see you guys.